think it's a very important part of the development of, of this country is, you know, having freedom of the, of the press and, and access to information. There is this law called, in, this law in Venezuela called Ley Resorte, <clears throat> which is basically a censorship law. Through that law, they not only forced people or newspapers and TV networks to quiet down a little bit, but also it costs a lot of people jo their jobs. Every totalitarian regime in modern history has uh, gained control of the press as a first measure. One of the biggest happenings in Venezuelan history in, rec in recent years was the year 2007 when Radio Caracas tele Television, which is <clears throat> was the most historical uh, TV channel, news channel in Venezuela, um, was, sh was shut down because of their strong opposition to the government. That's sort of the key to them uh, staying in power, is to sort of, you know, hoard information. If, if we skew the information, as they were saying, to serve a particular agenda, um, there's really no need even for informing anybody about it. That's where social media comes in, where the, the power of the individual to sort of tell his or her truth um, and to do it with some protection, maybe some anonymity, uh, they're able to challenge the regime and challenge those sort of authoritarian narratives that, that are obviously aimed at keeping the people in the dark. keep information from spreading. I know many people that have, like my aunt has been kidnapped, her son was kidnapped, many of my close friends have been kidnapped. I was kidnapped for six and a half hours. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure that two of the members involved were police officers. You try to avoid reporting because it doesn't actually do anything, you know. Over the past 15 years, it's, it's become like a twilight zone, like you don't know what's going to happen to you when you get out of your home. You don't know if you're going to come back. Honestly, my calling is for the international media to dig deeper, to help people. It's about saving lives.